love you, Lord. God, we glorify you. Just have thy own sweet way, Heavenly Father. As we look to you, Lord God Almighty, we, we glorify you, Lord. We, we, we tell you thanks, Heavenly Father. God, ju just, 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 just be glorified among us tonight, Heavenly Father. Just be lifted on high, Lord, as we give you the praise. We give you the honor. Shall we praise the Lord? Shall we praise the Lord? Shall we praise the Lord? Shall we lift our hands and worship the Lord? Can the worshipers lift their hands and shout hallelujah? Right under this open heaven, can we shout hallelujah? Can we open up our mouths, open up our spirits and, and shout another hallelujah? Come on, worshippers, can you shout another hallelujah? The, the demons and the devils, the, the, the wizards, hallelujah. those Glory watching and God. hearing pass her by, they, they must can hear hallelujah. the worshippers shout another hallelujah, hallelujah in the house. Can, can, we, can we shout? Hallelujah. Can, can we shout another hallelujah? hallelujah. Can we extend Glory our hands God. in praise? Can we hallelujah. open up our mouth? And, and, and give the Lord a, a, a moment of praise. Can we extend our spirit? Hallelujah! Can, can we just express ourselves to our God? How great is He? How worthy is He tonight? Oh, somebody help me to magnify the Lord. Oh, magnify the Lord with me tonight. Let we everything that has breath praise the Lord tonight. Let the redeemed of the Lord, the Lord, the Lord let the word peace. Oh, somebody help me to foster the presence of Almighty God tonight. Can, can you stand on your feet, everybody? Can you stand on your feet? This, this is holy ground. This is holy ground. Oh, somebody help me to praise God. This is holy ground. We declare. We declare the glory of God. We declare the power of God. We will summon the Lord's name. Somebody praise the Lord. Oh, let me hear the worshippers shout hallelujah. Let me hear the worshippers shout hallelujah. Please declare the Lord. Hallelujah. The name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous run in. I said the righteous run in. Hallelujah. Oh, the righteous run in. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And they are saved. Somebody praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Somebody praise the Lord. As our praise and worship team, they come to usher us into the presence of Almighty God. The next voice you will hear thereafter is that of our moderator in the name of the Lord. 
I now hand over to our praise and worship team as they will be coming to usher us as they worship God together in the name of the Lord. Somebody praise God. We worship Somebody Jesus. praise God. Hallelujah. We worship Hallelujah. 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 Can we continue lifting up the name of Jesus? Hallelujah. 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 Can we just worship his name? Hallelujah. Let's not stop our praise. Hallelujah. The word of God says your praise will ever be on my lips i will bless the lord at all times his praise shall continually be in my lips oh hallelujah hallelujah this evening as we worship as we sing hallelujah we pray that we'll experience the presence of god hallelujah anybody here for an encounter with god this evening hallelujah 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 I want to be where you are, dwelling in your presence, feasting at your table, surrounded by your glory. of the king of kings this evening hallelujah 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 so when we're in the presence of the lord what's what's our right response hallelujah 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 right posture a right physical posture when we're in the presence of the lord is to bow hallelujah so hallelujah, this evening we're going to bow down in worship. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. So this evening can we just let go and forget all about ourselves and just bow down and worship him. Hallelujah, hallelujah.
bow down, bow down, bow down, sing bow down. Worship Him. Oh, worship Him. Bow down before the King of Glory. place and just bow in recognition of the fact that we are in the presence of the Lord of glory hallelujah he's the definition of glory hallelujah hallelujah could we just bow I don't know how just find a place and for a moment just bow hallelujah bow if you want to kneel you can kneel if you want to just bow your head bow Hallelujah, the Lord of glory is in this place. Hallelujah, and we want to acknowledge his presence. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Just bow. Hallelujah, let's just bow. Just for a moment, just bow. Hallelujah, this is different, hallelujah. But we can continue just acknowledging the presence of the Lord of glory, hallelujah. Just bow in his presence, hallelujah. Is anyone feeling the presence of the Lord in this place? Hallelujah. He's here. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And let's just continue. Let's just entertain his presence by singing praises unto him. Hallelujah. 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 Oh, oh, oh. 
from the bonds of sin, hallelujah. Could we just praise him as though we're delivered, hallelujah. Giving everything to the King of Kings, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. I feel like, I feel like skipping, skipping praise for what he has done, he has it. and magnify the Lord. Can the church shout hallelujah? Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise God. At this time, my brothers and sisters, uh, indeed, as was mentioned, the next voice you hear after the praise and worship team is that of praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Come Coming to us at this time, sisters, is Sister Sister Garwood will be coming to carry over. To, to carry out the devotional activities after which Sister Stasian Virtue will be coming to do the opening prayer in the name of the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Is there another hallelujah? Is there another hallelujah? Indeed, we are happy to be here tonight, the final night for camp meeting, 2022. God has been good to us. He has been good to us. This evening, we want to look at the scripture which comes to us from St. Mark 5, and I'll read from verse 1 to 20. And it reads, And they came over unto the other side of the sea, into the country of Gad Gadarenes. And when he was come out of the ship, immediately there met him out of the tombs a man with an unclean spirit, who had his dwelling among the tombs. And no man could bind him, no, not with chains, because that he had been often bound with fetters and chains, and the chains had been plucked asunder by him, 
and the fetters broken in pieces, neither could any man tame him. And always, night and day, he was in the mountains and in the tombs, crying and cutting himself with stones. But when he saw Jesus afar off, he ran and worshipped him, and cried with a loud voice, and said, What have I to do with thee, Jesus, thou Son of the Most High God? I adjure thee by God, that thou torment me not. For he said unto him, Come out of the man, thou unclean spirit. And he asked him, What is thy name? And he answered, saying, My name is Legion, for we are many. And he besought him much that he would not send them away out of the country. Now there was there nigh unto the mountains a great herd of swine feeding, and all the devils besought him, saying, Send us in the swine, that we may enter into them. And forthwith Jesus gave them leave, and the unclean spirits went out, and entered into the swine. And the herd ran violently down a steep place into the sea. They were about 2,000 and were choked in the sea. And they that fed the swine fled and told it in the city and in the country. And they went out to see what it was that was done. And they come, they come to Jesus and see him that was possessed with the devil and had the legion sitting and clothed and in his right mind. And they were afraid. And they that saw it told them how it befell to him that was possessed with the devil, and also concerning the swine. And they began to pray to him, depart out of the, their coast. And when he was come into the ship, he that had been possessed with the devil prayed him that he might be with him. How be it? Jesus suffered him not, but said unto him, Go home to thy friends, and tell them how great things the Lord had done for thee, and had compassion on thee. 20. And he departed, and began to publish in Decapolis how great things Jesus had done for him, and all men did marvel. This is the word of the Lord we honor by saying, thanks be to God. Amen. Bless the Lord. Can we all turn our hymnals to hymn 376? Precious name, how sweet. I'll ask the praise team to... Hallelujah. Start. Shall we bless the name of the Lord? Hallelujah. Shall we exalt the name of the Lord? Praise the name. Shout of hallelujah. Jesus. Hallelujah. Shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to the most high God. Take the name of Jesus with, with you. Child of sorrow and of woe. gives you take it everywhere you go oh precious name
Deacon Hilton just to come on here and he will open up in prayer in the name of the Lord. mercies Lord we thank you God for your goodness Lord we thank you God that you have brought us again on this spot of ground Lord to bless your name to lift up your name tonight Lord 
Lord, we commit ourselves unto you again, Lord. After five nights of service here, Lord, we ask God that your Holy Spirit will dwell richly amongst us tonight. One that we have never seen before. Lord, we ask that you'll move from chair to chair, from front to back, on the street, Lord, pass us by, Lord. We ask God that you will touch them in a very special way, Lord. As the word go forth tonight, Lord, souls will be saved for your kingdom. Lord, we present ourselves before you. We present a preacher, Lord, as he preach, Lord God, as he set forth the words tonight, God. Souls will be touched, Lord. Our hearts will be blessed. Lord, we thank you again, Lord, for the weather, Lord. We ask, God, that you'll hold back the rain, Lord, tonight, Lord, as we seek to worship you in spirit and in truth. Lord, we glorify your name, Lord. We ask that every heart tonight, Lord, will be so taken up with your word, Lord, that, Lord, we receive a blessing, Lord. We come against the plans of the adversary, because we know that he's, he's vexed, Lord. He's He's against us, Lord. He's our greatest enemy. So tonight we come against him in the name of Jesus Christ. We ask God that we have a blessed moment tonight with you, Lord. As we embrace you, Lord. As we embrace your Holy Spirit, Lord. We ask God that you'll move again, Lord. Like you have never done before. Lord, we just give you the glory tonight, Lord. We give you the praise. We give you the honor. As we all say, Amen and Amen. God bless you. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Shall we lift our hands and magnify the Lord? Praise God. Praise God. Let me thank Sister Garwood. Praise Lord. Praise God. Deacon Hilton for their participation thus far in the next program. My sisters and brothers, it's very good to see all of you back again on the old campground hallelujah for us to worship the lord for us to glorify god hallelujah to trample upon the enemy and to really populate heaven by seeking souls for the kingdom of god and allowing the devil to be shame and afraid of us because we are like a mighty army armed and dangerous under the anointing of almighty god anybody agree with me tonight anybody agree with me tonight can you lift your hands and shout hallelujah like a warrior can i hear the warrior shout hallelujah can i hear the warrior shout hallelujah can i feel the warrior shout another hallelujah can I hear the warrior shout hallelujah? Praise God, hallelujah. To God we are warriors in the name of the Lord. Praise God. My brothers and sisters coming at this time to do the welcome and acknowledgement. That is our sister, Sister Kamoy Hudson in the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Rev. God bless you. A pleasant evening to you all. It is my pleasure to welcome you to the final night of Camp Meeting 2022. If you are happy to be in the presence of the Lord, let me hear your shout. Hallelujah. 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 Bless the Lord. Oh, what a week we have been having. Hallelujah. Souls were blessed. People were healed, and I'm sure we've heard the testimonies of deliverance. So surely the presence of God has been in this place. Let me acknowledge the presence of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Let me acknowledge our pastors, Bishop Ruel Robinson and Reverend Lee Paul Francis, along with their families. Our guest speaker, Evangelist Clayton Roberts. Bless you, sir. If we and wife, thank you for coming, madam, supporting your husband. Bless you. If we have any other minister in the audience, we thank you for coming. We, are, we I ask you to stand if we have any other minister in the audience. Okay. To our online worshipers, 
we thank you for tuning in to our services. We truly appreciate you. Continue watching and remember to like, share, and subscribe if you have not yet done so. To our members and friends who are here, thank you for coming out this evening. We truly appreciate you being here, especially on a Friday evening. God bless you. Do we have our new converts? We call them our VIPs. May I ask you all to stand, our VIPs? Yes. Give them a round of applause. Let me say congratulations and welcome to the family of God. Bless you. Again, thank you for coming out. We look forward to an awesome time in the presence of the Lord. Let's go and ha let God have his way. And I say thank you again. God bless you. Have a wonderful evening. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise God. My sisters and brothers, I'll be asking us at this time, as we are about to sing our theme song, to, uh, to, to stand, to turn, our, to turn our remembrance, and for those that have programs, to uh, the second to last song, or the first, yes, the first song on the program my god delivers again the praise and worship team will be coming at this time to to lead us into this song i'm gonna invite us everybody just to stand everybody just to stand as we worship god together with the praise and worship team Yeah. 
Somebody go ahead and praise the Lord. If you know that your God delivers again, lift your hands and shout hallelujah. Lift your hands and shout another hallelujah. If you know that your God is a deliverer, shout hallelujah. Look on your neighbor and tell your neighbor, say neighbor, my God is a deliverer. Look at somebody and tell them, say my God, Fimi God is a deliverer. Hallelujah to God. Somebody praise the Lord. Somebody praise the Lord. I said, somebody praise the Lord. Glory to Hallelujah. God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Our God is a deliverer. Hallelujah. Just before you sit down, don't, don't, don't sit yet. We want to take a few testimonies, about four testimonies from the, from the, from the audience as to the saving grace, the saving grace of Almighty God is keeping power that has been preserving it that would have saved you and continue to preserve you right upon tonight, right unto this day. Amen, everybody. Amen, everyone. Amen. I want the praise and worship team to grab a hold of their mics. Praise the Lord. We're going to sing unto the glory of Almighty God. Amen, everybody. Amen, everybody. Praise the Lord. It is all right, all right. It is all right, all right. As long as I have my Lord beside me, it is all right. As long as I have his hands too. Oh, as long as he watches over my soul. As long as I'm under his control. It is all right. It is all right. As long as I have my Lord beside me, it is alright. As long as I have His hands to hold, as long as He's what He's over my soul, as long as I'm under His control, it is alright. It is alright. It is alright. Come on, church. We're taking four testimonies tonight. We want the converse to hear of the saving grace and power of Almighty God. Glory to God. Oh, I'm under His control. It is alright. One more time, I'm is say it is alright. Oh, it is alright. It is alright. As long as I have my Lord beside me, it is alright. As long as I have his hands to hold, as long as he watches over my soul, as long as I'm under his control, it is all I say it is alright, I miss it, it is alright, alright, it is alright, alright. As long as I have his hands to hold, as long as he watches over my soul, as long as I'm under his control, it is alright. Oh yes, it is alright, alright, it is alright, alright. As long as I have my Lord beside me, put the persons with the testimony. Can you make your way to the to the front? Hallelujah! Over my soul, as long as I'm under His control, it is alright. Put those hands together. Hallelujah! Glory! Time. 
One more time. One more time. One last time. It is alright. Good God. He's what she's over my soul As long as I'm under his control If you know it is alright Lift your hands and shout hallelujah Lift your hands and shout glory Somebody shout glory Somebody shout hallelujah Good God Almighty Testify sister In the name of the Lord Praise the Lord. I want to greet you all in the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. I am Joanne Sinclair. It so happened that, you know, I end up got immersed here into this church in 2019. And uh, from that day onward, I have been backslide. You know, I've been here, there, and everywhere. But the Lord spoke to me each time I'm at my house. The Spirit of God been talking to me to say, go Montego Bay. So my sister and I is here. Hallelujah, Jesus. It so happened that uh, I listened to the preacher the other night uh, talking about Jesus and talking about angel. It so happened that when I was at my house in, in Bull Bay, St. Andrew, I was sleeping, and while I was sleeping, the Spirit of God awake me, and I saw Jesus. He have on a white robe, he have on a white robe, and I he have on tons of crowns upon his head, and I began to cry because of the tons of crown upon his head. Hallelujah, Jesus! Hallelujah! Satan of Satan, you surely became tired of Satan. Hallelujah! Glory to God. So I began to cry. And uh, then Jesus disappeared. And the Spirit of God spoke to me and said, Had the midnight cry. Hallelujah, Jesus. Yes. Hallelujah. So it so happened that with the angel now, I was sleeping again and the Spirit of God awake me. And when the Spirit of God awake me, I saw an angel robe in white. And uh, the angel watches over me. And then he disappeared. And the Spirit of God spoke to me and said, the angel of the Lord. Hallelujah, Jesus. And there again, another angel, I shift my bed to the, to the uh, other corner. And another angel appeared to me upon white robe and have some things on him looking like diamonds. And then the angel disappeared. So I just want to continue to keep, keep the faith because ain't no giving up, I got to go on. Though the way get harder, I got to go on. So you saints that are in Christ and filled with the Spirit, God shall put in his appearance anytime. So you got to be ready to meet him when he comes. Don't be as the five foolish virgins. Hallelujah, Jesus. So be ready and waiting when Jesus comes. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I am determined to hold out to the end. Jesus is with me, on him I can depend. For I know I have salvation, I feel it in my soul. I am determined to hold out to the end. I am determined. Hold out to the head. Jesus is with me. On him I can depend. For I know I have salvation. I give my soul. I am determined to hold out to the head. I am determined. I am determined to hold out to the head. Jesus is with me, 
Somebody praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Somebody praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise Hallelujah. God. Hallelujah. Good evening, brethren and friends, once more. Um, this evening, I'm here to testify, um, preaching to the choir, meaning I'm talking specifically to the saints. Hallelujah. Um, this year, I think, has been the roughest year of my life so far. Many times I... I never knew it was possible to fall so many times. And you know, some people classify sins. Oh, if you fornicate, that's a terrible sin. If, you, if you're full of pride, that's not such a bad sin. All wrongdoing is sin. So if we fall, we fall into sin. If we fall into habitual lying, it is sin. So I would have, fall, I would have fallen no, a number of times and I would have felt like, you know, God, God was upset with me. It was this for me, it was it for me. You know, many times within the past year, I've never been this suicidal. It's possible for Christians to be suicidal. It's possible for Christians to be depressed. But so many times mentally in my heart, I had given up. But God was still selling mes sending messages to me not to give up, even after I had already given up. So I'm here to encourage somebody this evening. Regardless of what sin you have fallen into, you feel like, you feel like, oh, I'm not even clean enough to come to church. Don't give up. Don't leave the church. Even if you fall, the worst place you can go is outside of the presence and coverage of God. Don't give up. I'm a young person. I'm talking to the young people, old people alike. We all sin, we all fall, but when you fall, know that our God is still compassionate. He's still merciful. He is slow to anger with us all. He is slow to anger with us all. I don't know who I'm talking to. Don't give up. God still loves you. Keep on keeping on. God still loves you. Don't give up. Don't lose the faith. Don't leave church. <laughs> okay? Don't leave church. The devil would want us to go out into the world so that he can further take us over but no when we slip when we fall god takes us up back and he's ready to go forward with us if god hasn't give up given up on you don't give up on yourself keep on keeping on god bless you somebody lift your hands and praise the lord somebody lift your hands and praise the lord somebody lift your hands and praise the lord we want to take two more testimonies from the the audience want to take two more testimonies as, as to how good the Lord has been to you. Somebody praise God. Somebody praise the Lord. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Shall we praise the Lord? Shall we worship the Lord? To God be the glory. Great things he has done. I just want to thank God for salvation. And because of salvation tonight, I can say to God, be the glory. Brethren, I got saved 2004. Hallelujah. A Friday night like this, glory to God, and a pastor notice ministry. Glory to God, I got saved. Brethren, when I come to church on Friday night, glory to God, my heart has been touched by the word of God. And I went home the night Glory to God. Early in the morning. Glory to God. I get up out of my bed. And I search under the anger. Glory to God. And I take out all of the clothes that I have wearing the world. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And brethren, I look, I will see one blouse. One skirt. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And I take that one skirt that day. And I wear it come to church. Glory to God. Now the second to wear. Hallelujah. And at the second to wear him on the one blows and the one skirt because all I have is out there in the world. Brethren, God is a good God. And say, friend, I'm telling the VIP, don't give up. Hold on because God is a good God. God never fails. 
us feel God, but God will feel us. I take that one skirt and praise God. You can do the same thing too. I take that one blows and serve God. Sometimes I come to church, I hold it up so. Because it's still right big. Glory to God Almighty. Because God is a good God. God is a good God, brethren. I eat flesh out. So tell me not sick. When I went to the shop, the person one, the, the, the shopkeeper tell me that you buy too much tin fish. You buy too much tin fish. I mean, say, God, you hear God? You hear? I went to another shop for church. The man shame me. We say, all right, Mr. Church, I go and tap church. I mean, tell your brethren, right now, right now, I am so blessed. My family are blessed. Glory to God. Hallelujah. My daughter go to school and go to high school. Then go to college. My daughter to do nine subjects and get the nine at once. My daughter gets six. Glory to God and God keep on blessing me and my family. My son play football overseas. What a way God good. My son play football overseas. God has said bless to my family. Brethren, pray for me in Jesus' name. Somebody praise the Lord. Somebody praise the Lord. Glory. Can the church stand with me tonight and praise the Lord? Hallelujah. Can the worship us stand with me tonight and praise the Lord? Hallelujah. Somebody praise the Lord. Hey. Hallelujah. Can't stop this tonight. Somebody praise God. Hallelujah. I said the devil can't mess up this tonight. Somebody lift your hands and shout hallelujah. hallelujah. Somebody shout hallelujah. hallelujah. I look down the road and I wonder. Yes, I wonder. Yes, I wonder. Yes, I look down the road and I wonder. I up my shoes and I journey, yes I journey, I journey, I buckle up my shoes and I journey, I journey up to God, yes I look down the road and I wonder, yes I wonder, yes I wonder, I wonder, I wonder, I look down the road and I wonder, for how far I am from God I buckle up my shoes and I journey Yes I journey Yes I journey Oh yes I buckle up my shoes and I journey I journey home to God I look down the road and I Yes, I say, I buckle up my shoes 
Tonight. Hallelujah. Somebody praise God. Praise the Lord. Somebody praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Feel the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. I said, Somebody praise God. Hallelujah. Somebody help me to praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The demons they must tremble when we praise God. Oh, somebody help me to worship God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I feel a loosening in the spirit. Somebody must come home tonight. Delivering the captives in the name of the Lord. Glory to God. Glory to God. Is there one last testimony? Praise God. Praise God. We're going to ask Brother O'Neill Donaldson to come to us. Praise God. Praise God. Praise the Lord. Good evening, church. I'm going to try and sing this song. Make it short. Make it very short. Glory. I was in the hospital a few months ago. Could not have sing. And tonight, I'm just going to try. I'm going to try because I've been testing it. And I know I can do it. Just back me up. I serve my... God who reigns in heaven above in majesty supreme so long a morning inside my life has shown
persuaded that God will see me through. Put your hands together for our God that continues to see you. Our sister through. You want to testify, Sister Campbell? All right. That God will see me through. Last year was a year full of ups and downs. And I'm still going through, but God will see me through. I went for a lab test today. And it's not looking good. But I am persuaded that God will see me through. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Don't feel sorry for me because God will see me through. And if you miss me shouting down here, take a walk. Because I'll be somewhere around the throne of God. Hallelujah. God will see me through. Bless you. Somebody praise God. Somebody praise the Lord again. Praise God. At this time, brother. Thank you. Just, just before brother Donald comes to minister to us, station wagon with the license plate number 52. Six seven, you are blocking someone that needs with a capital N needs to leave black station wagon five two six seven white sorry white station wagon five two six seven JB you're blocking someone that needs to to go praise God white station wagon the Lord bless you. Brother Donald will be coming to us at this time in the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Continue to worship the Lord, people. Continue to praise the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Tell Jesus all of my trials, I cannot bear these burdens alone in my distress. He promised to help me He ever loves And cares for his own Tempted and tried Need a great Savior one who can help my burdens to bear and i must tell jesus i must tell jesus he all my cares and sorrows will share so i must tell jesus i must tell jesus oh i cannot bear these burdens alone i must tell jesus I must tell Jesus, Jesus can help me, yes, Jesus alone, I 
I must tell Jesus, hallelujah, all of my troubles. He is a kind, compassionate friend. And if I but ask him, he will deliver and make up my troubles quickly and then if you believe it let's sing this together and I must tell Jesus I must tell Jesus oh I cannot bear these burdens alone so I must tell Jesus I must tell Jesus Jesus can help me oh Jesus alone ask this question what must I do when worldliness calls me? What must I do when tempted to sin? I must tell Jesus and He will help me. victory to win oh so I must tell Jesus and I must tell Jesus for I cannot bear these burdens alone hallelujah and I must tell Jesus I must tell Jesus, Jesus can help me, yes, oh, Jesus alone. Say, I must tell Jesus, I must tell Jesus, oh, I must tell Jesus, oh, I cannot bear. alone, alone, and I must tell Jesus, oh, I must tell Jesus, Jesus can help me, Jesus can help you, do you believe it tonight? Jesus can help me, yes, Jesus alone. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Just go ahead and praise the Lord. Just go ahead and magnify the Lord. Somebody lift your hands and shout glory. Shout a hallelujah. God is moving by his spirit. Hallelujah. And we want to give God thanks for the way in which he is moving. God be the glory. Thank you very much, Brother Donaldson. Praise God for your ministry tonight. Hallelujah. My sisters and brothers, as you have heard me said earlier or a while ago, that God is moving by his spirit. And there's a particular text in the word of the Lord that declares that the Lord added to the church daily. Such as to be, to be saved. And we give God thanks for the way in which he has been moving here 
at Montego Bay and saving lives and delivering his people. Hallelujah. Out of captivity and a life of bondage to sin. And I know that tonight we have uh, some of our sisters and brothers uh, who the Lord would have uh, recently saved them by his grace and power. Hallelujah. They have been saved, uh, and follow me, you have been saved uh, since, uh, the, since last week of, uh, of our fasting service up unto this point. Uh, during the week of this camp meet, you are here. All our converts, whether you have been saved last week, since this week, I'm going to ask all of them to stand. All our new converts, just to stand. All of you. All of you. Whether it is that you were saved in this, in this camp meeting, you were saved last week, two weeks ago, I'm going to ask all of you to stand. I thought the church would be clapping them louder than who they are right now. I thought the church would be more excited for them. It seems I'm the only one who is excited. The drummers, the drummers seem excited. The keyboards seem excited. The basses seem excited. Can all the worshipers put your hands together for them tonight? Glory to God. All of them. I'm going to ask them just to stand up. I'm joining them on the, on, the, on the lower ground. I'm going to ask all of them just to come on here. All of you. All of you. Be coming down for now. Come. All of you. All our converts. The Lord has been good. Somebody praise the Lord. Somebody praise the Lord. Just line out. Look at them and give God praise, believers. Look at them and give God praise, believers. Oh, the church not saying nothing down here. The church not saying nothing over here. If you're excited for the move of God, help me to praise God. If your bad mind tapping eyes, what if you if you're rejoicing tonight, help me to praise God. Oh, somebody praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I remember where I'm coming from. Oh, help me now, somebody. Had it not been for the grace of Almighty God. Hallelujah. Does anybody remember where you're coming from? Some of us, we were born saved, so you don't understand. You don't understand anything. But if you remember where, the, where Jesus took you from, just lift your hands. In a mood of gratitude and just let us something in this atmosphere. The preacher man would say just bust a move, bust a praise. Somebody help me to praise God. Glory to God. With the privilege given to me, I'm going to ask them just to give us 30 seconds. Not two minutes. 30 seconds. And just tell us how God has been good. Just testify. 30 seconds. And if you go over, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to point and as you go over. Amen. Glory. Glory. Good night, everyone. I'm happy to be here for the final night. I've never give up. I fight and I make it. Give God thanks. For what I've been through, the ups and downs. I don't know how to start, but it's just going to be short. I just have to say, God is good all the time. Somebody praise God. Give us 30 minutes, 30 seconds. Just tell us how God has been good. Thank the Lord for saving you, delivering you. Um. <clears throat> Uh, thank you, Lord. Um, Speak from your heart. Speak from your heart. Uh, 
I'm going through many trials and crosses, and I thank the Lord yes. to keep me. Yes. <laughs> can do it. Go ahead. Don't stop. Yes. Let it go. Let it go. You. Somebody praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Somebody praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Somebody praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I'm going to give it back to her to finish off what she started off saying with. Thank the Lord for delivering, delivering me. Um, I should... Die and gone, but the Lord has keep me safe. Yes. Glory. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, Glory. for keeping me safe. Yes. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you. Somebody help me to praise the Lord. You don't understand. Somebody just help me to praise God. Can you just lift your hands and shout hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. I thank God for where I reached tonight. And it's a long journey. I'm suffering all over all these years. And since these five nights, it's been so wonderful. I thank God for his mercy. Uh, is the same God yesterday, today, and forevermore. Thank you, Jesus, for inviting me in this church. And God bless you. Somebody lift your hands and give God praise. Or oh, somebody help me to praise God. Somebody help me to shout hallelujah. Onliners help me to praise God. My God delivers again. I say, my God, deliver us again. Somebody shout hallelujah. Good night, church. Where I'm coming from. I'm going to sing just one little song of this testimony. God's children too long. As be burden, I will carry my cross to the midnight and the question, Father alone. You see where I'm coming from? I am going through a rough time. I have a sister. Sometimes I am carrying a burden. But God, but God does ride out your storm. Somebody glorify God. Somebody glorify God in the house. Praise God. Let us praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I give God thanks for what he has done for me. He done many things for me. I remember I was having sugar. Sunday gone, pastor was praying and praying about sugar and pressure. Monday morning when I went home, Sunday night when I went home, I get up in the morning and I test the sugar. It was just one, zero, one. Who could it be more than the almighty God? God did it. And he will do it for me, he will do it for you. Just worship the Lord. Give your heart to God. Don't, don't hold too long to give your heart to God. It is just time now for God to put in his appearance. I'm giving, I'm giving thanks to the Almighty God. And I'm asking you, please pray me up while I pray my strength in Jesus' name. Thank you. Somebody praise the Lord. Look at what the Lord is doing here at Montego Bay. Oh, somebody who is excited for the Lord, help me to shout hallelujah. Somebody shout another hallelujah. Somebody shout another hallelujah. Somebody shout another hallelujah. Somebody shout glory. 
Look where you brought me from. Look where you brought me from. I was lost in the Lord God. Look where you brought music. My God. Look where you brought me from. Oh, look where you brought me from. I was stand up with my worshipers. Where's the prayer team? Lord God Almighty, look where. I said, look where you brought. Look at your name and tell them, look where. Look what God we are talking about. I was doing my own thing. Lord, I feel worship. Look at somebody and tell them, say, look where he brought me. Lord God. I was Lord Glory Look at somebody and tell them Look where he brought me You know the one I said look where you brought me from I was My God Oh yes look where Oh yes look where Look where he brought me from Oh yes, my God, look where! Can we do it one more time? Look where He brought me from! God, God, look where He brought me from! Oh, I was. Oh yes, look where! And we sing the song, a mighty long way, Lord, Lord God. Am I to long way? Am I to long way? I got there tonight. Can't meet him live tonight. My God, am I to long way? 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 Oh, am I to long way, Lord? Look where you brought me from. One more time, am I to long way? Am I to long dance with me, church of God? Good God, my God, am I to long way? Am I to long way? God is a good God. God is a sweet God. Glorify the Lord. Look where you brought me One last time. One last time. Bishop, one more time. Am I to long way? Am I to long way? Am I to long way? Oh, look where you brought me from. Somebody who excited for God, lift your hands and shout hallelujah. Somebody shout hallelujah. What a God. Look at somebody and tell them what a God. If you ever know me, I come from. Look upon them and tell them what a God. What a God. God Almighty, God Almighty, Jesus, sweet. Sit down, worshippers. Sit down, Jesus, sweet team, man. Eh 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 eh. Look upon them and say, Jesus, sweet team, man. Eh eh. Lord God Almighty, preacher, Jesus, sweet. Eh eh. <laughs> I feel God in the house. Praise God. Worshippers, this is what Zion is about. 
this is what praise in God and them say church boring but I lie them I tell you. When them I talk say? I lie them I tell. Lie them. Somebody help me to praise God. Hallelujah. Somebody help me to praise God. Hallelujah. Somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God. Sickness in our body, but we are praise God. Yes. Cross is now in life, but we are going to praise God. Yes. Oh, somebody not someone not understand what I talk about. But someone who don't know who you know sickness in the body. Cross is now in life, but I'm gonna lift my hands and I'm gonna praise God. Glory. Can I ask the ushers to join me? One to my right with the basket. And one to my left. Hallelujah. Glory. We're going to continue to worship. Continue to worship. And we're going to go into this aspect. We're in giving. We're going to worship in giving. Worship God with our substance. It's an act of worship. I want us to be aware of the realities that face us that it takes cash to broadcast takes cash to care it takes cash to host this move here at Montego Bay the ushers would have given some envelopes for persons to sow seeds into this camp meet my online viewers wherever you are watching from i want to ask you to sow a seed a sacrificial seed in this ministry to sow a sacrificial seed in this ministry and watch how the Lord will move on your behalf by faith. Not because I have, I will give. But sacrificially, I'm going to give it to the Lord. You may be here with your envelopes. You may be here with an offering. I'm going to ask you. As the praise and worship team, we'll be singing a few songs. We'll be going to worship the Lord in giving. My online friends, those watching online, there's a few instructions that is on the screen right now that can give you the, the necessary instructions, the ideal, the precise instructions to give to this ministry on sportopen.com and our local bank account here in Jamaica. Give to a worthy cause in the name of the Lord. I'm going to ask the ushers to stand one here, stand to my left. Come, sister, stand right here. I'm going to ask those that are on this side, march up. give in this basket those that are on this side give in this basket could I ask us to grab a hold of our offering right now grab a hold of our offering right now grab a hold could we stand could we stand could we stand could we stand Hold that offering, that sacrificial offering in your hand. Raise it in this, under this open heaven. Father God, we thank you for your people who will be sowing into this ministry. Sacrificially, Lord, as they are about to give, we pray that you will anoint those hands, those offerings. God, we pray, Lord, that every situation that is in their lives, that God, you will move, you will breathe upon it, Lord. 
just as how you breathed upon the waters and there became breathe into their lives lord and allow deliverance to be wrath deliverance to be to be made whole lord breakthrough lord miracles signs and wonders that child that husband lord that 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 that, that trouble they have at work we pray in the name of jesus deliver them in the name of jesus as they give their soul to a worthy cause honor their seed faith offering their offering in the name of jesus christ of nazareth somebody help me to praise the lord somebody help me to praise the lord hallelujah hallelujah praise god hallelujah a mighty long way lord a mighty long way a mighty long way lord a mighty long way a mighty long way lord a mighty long way look where you go me sing a mighty long way a mighty long way mighty long way mighty long way mighty long way a mighty long way a mighty long way look where you go me sing a mighty long way
upon sin I have met the man who took away the heavy load. Now I am rejoicing. I am sin free, free, free. I am upon sin free. I have met the man who took away the load. Somebody praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Somebody praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God in the highest. Praise the Lord. My brothers and sisters, indeed, we are giving God thanks for his awesomeness towards us and uh, really to sing a praises unto his name to the most high coming to us at this time you may be seated if you can to sing praises unto the most high is our combined choir tonight consisting of the youths and the teens choir put your hands together for them the next voice you will hear after the combined choir is that of our host, Pastor Bishop Robinson, in the name of the Lord. God bless you, everybody. Good worship. Keep the worship. Don't catch it. Look at him and tell him, don't catch your worship. Tell him, not catch your worship. Not true. That's right. God bless you, the youth choir. Up, 
Now you made a way When our backs were against the wall And it looks as if it was all Lord, you made a way And we're standing here Only because you You made a way And it looked like Say you Made a way And we're standing here Only because you've made a way And you move mountains Say you move mountains, you cause walls to fall with your power. Perform miracles, there is nothing that's impossible, and we're standing here only because. Say you move mountains, you cause walls to fall with your power, Lord. Perform miracles, there is nothing, no, that's impossible. And we're standing here only because, say, we're standing here. Only because we're standing here. Only because you made you made you made a way. Hallelujah. You made a way, Lord. You made a way. Oh. I don't know how Say I don't know how Say I don't know how But you did it Don't know how Say I don't know why But I'm grateful Lord All you've done for me I praise your name Lord I'm so grateful, Lord. Oh, I'm grateful. Hallelujah. I'm so grateful, Lord. I'm so grateful. And we're standing here only because you. And we're standing here. Can you stand with me, Lord? Can you stand with me? And we're standing only because you've made a way. You've made a way, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. 
remain standing come on if he made the way for you just online and those who are standing before me beside behind on the street come on raise those hands he made the way come on take a moment and give him thanks for making the way some of us should not have been here we should be among the victims of covid we should be among the victim of those who are slain by the gun by the knife we are supposed some of us supposed to be among the carnages on the nation street some of us we were supposed to be in the hospital now battling life between life and death some of us were supposed to be searching the garbage bin for a day's meal but look at us we are numbered with the worshipers come on now come on lift up those hands lift up those hands come on give him a praise give him a praise everybody everything that had breath praise the lord the man of god is in the house i'm in a different mood tonight his wife is sitting in the front row we give god thanks for him a man that needs no introduction amen it was spelled out last night reverend uh roberts in care of the holy ghost put those hands together for him in jesus name hallelujah 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 give god a camp meeting praise tonight give god a friday night praise tonight come on lift up the name of jesus come on lift up the name of jesus come on leave everything on the court tonight leave the park tonight we're gonna give god everything tonight give him worship hallelujah 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 when i look back over my life from where god has brought us from just take 60 seconds and give him the best praise you brought with you tonight give him the best praise you brought with you tonight give him the best praise you brought with you tonight hallelujah 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 we glorify you we magnify you we lift your name high hallelujah come on 40 more seconds we exalt you we magnify you we glorify your name you are king of kings you are lord of lords you are the conquering lion of the tribe of judah who is like unto you O god among gods glorious in holiness fearful in praises doing wonders wonders in my life wonders in your life wonders in montego bay come on montego bay come on camp meeting lift your voice like a trumpet and call upon the name of our god for the name of the lord is a strong tower and the righteous run it therein and they are safe hallelujah hallelujah somebody lift up a militant cry come on lift up a militant shout come on lift up a militant praise for he is worthy he is worthy he is worthy he is worthy to be praised hallelujah 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 i've got my praise with me tonight and i'm not going back with one praise i'm gonna leave all my praise here tonight hallelujah 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 glory 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 for the lord is good and his mercies endure it forever praise god be seated in the presence of the lord hallelujah surely the presence of the lord is in this place somebody honor the holy ghost somebody honor the spirit of god hallelujah hallelujah allow me to give honor to god's choice servants this evening uh, bishop ruel robinson 
Would you put your hands together for God's choice servant? Praise God. And the one who completes him, Sister Robinson, bless you, woman of God. Praise God. Oriel, pick up yourself. Praise God. Olivia, if you're watching, bless you wherever you are. Let me also give honor to associate pastor, Pastor Lee Paul Francis. Would you put your hands together for Pastor Francis and his darling wife? Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. All the leaders of this noble house, all the leaders, uh, deacons, deaconesses, whatever office you hold, please accept Christian greetings in Jesus' name. Would you just give somebody a good thump of fist tonight? Just thump off somebody if you say, say, big up yourself, yeah, man. Come on, just say, big up, big up yourself. I say, yeah, man, praise God. Hallelujah, praise God Almighty. Let me also honor all those who are watching on YouTube, praise God. I want to honor Haven of Hope. I know they are watching tonight. Praise the name of the Lord. Prayer closet, big up yourself. Amen, praise the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Tonight, tonight is Friday night. And let me see all those who used to do road. They used to do road. They used to do road hard. I, I'm sorry, Montego Bay do, doesn't know what do road means. <laughs> Praise God. Let me see all those who used to do road. All them hours here, we don't leave yard yet. Talk to me, man. We don't, we, don't, we don't have way toothbrush and way clocks don't clean off. Hello. Them bad 11, 12 o'clock. Ready for God. Do road. Somebody said do road. And those who know about the road, we do road hard. Talk to me somebody. So some people expect us to do road hard and come to church and do church soft. If we used to do road hard, we are do God harder. We are do praise harder. We are do worship harder. We are say hallelujah harder. Talk to me in the church of God. Praise the name of Jesus. I, I got saved in the era where we used to do the bogle. Talk to me. We used to signal playing. We used to do de la move. So someone don't know which era being saved in a door. Praise God. Some people used to do the butterfly and the tatty. A girl, a girl dance them one day. We don't do them dance. Praise God. Some people used to do the gangster bunks and them thing there. Praise God. I don't know what era you got saved in. Praise God. Maybe you got saved just last year when people were walking like dog. You're not talking to me, church of God. Praise the name of Jesus Christ. But I don't know what era you got saved in. But if you know that you are sweetly saved and you know Jesus, let the redeemed of the Lord say something in this open space tonight let the redeem of the lord let the world know that we have been bought with a price jesus has changed my whole life praise god let me allow me to just dive into the word of god tonight the text was already read from saint mark chapter 5 and it was read from 1 to 20 allow me to read two verses from saint luke chapter 9 verse 1 and 2 saint luke chapter 9 verse 1 and 2 and it reads then he called his this 12 disciples together and gave them power and authority over all devils and to cure diseases and he sent them to preach the kingdom of God and to heal the sick. If it's nice, you read it twice. All right. Then he called his 12 disciples together and gave them power and authority over all devils and to cure diseases. And he sent them to preach the kingdom of God and to heal the sick this is the word of the lord somebody say somebody show with me delivering the captives come on say it again delivering the captives one more time shout delivering the captives now there is no doubt that jesus came to set the captives free 
There's no doubt about it. For St. Luke chapter 4, the Bible says when he stood up in the tabernacle in the temple, they handed him the book. And the place was found in Isaiah chapter 61. And he said, read, he read, the spirit of the Lord God is upon me. For the Lord has anointed me to preach good tidings to the poor. To bind up the wounds of the brokenhearted. To set at liberty those who are bruised. To set captives free. When he read, he says this, this, this word, this prophecy is now fulfilled in your ears. I am come to set the captives free. In fact, St. John tells us, 1 John tells us uh, that devil sins from the, those who sin uh, is of the devil for he sins from the beginning. For this purpose was the son of man made manifest that he might destroy the works of the devil. Jesus came to set the captives free. The reason you and I can testify is not because we have matriculated from the upper echelon of the university. We can't testify about our possessions, but we can testify that Jesus set me free one day. He broke the bars of prison for me. Someday in glory, his face I, I shall see glory be to God. He set me free. My greatest testimony is not about a house is not about a car is not about a van is not about property my greatest testimony is that Jesus rescued me from a life of sin Jesus picked me up he turned me around and he planted my feet on higher ground give somebody high five I said that's my testimony also Jesus set the captives free understanding this you understand that when jesus came he didn't just come that he may set the captives free but he called disciples so that they also can set captives free tonight the lord says preach to the deliverers and preach to the captives for god says that there are some deliverers that have forgotten that God has called you to be deliverers. Mm. Put your hand on your chest. If you're a believer, say, I am a deliverer. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I am a deliverer I hear the Holy Ghost while I was praying the Holy Ghost said there are some persons who have forgotten that they have been called to deliver others why? because some persons have been tired some persons have been beaten some people have been battered and because of that you have put down your ministry, you have put down your calling you have put down that which God has called you to do but the Holy Ghost says to remind you that you are a deliverer I don't care what you are in right now. Jesus says you are one of my deliverers. Some persons forgot that they are deliverers and they have fallen by the wayside, fallen into sin, and you have been staying in sin. Say, I want to go back, but I can't go back. The Holy Ghost is calling you back, for you are one of the deliverers. I don't care how far, far you have fallen. The righteous fallen seven times, but have enough sense to get back up again in the name of Jesus. Would you tell your neighbor, get up again. Come on, tell somebody, get up again. Hallelujah to God. The devil want you to stay down. But I want to deliver it tonight to get back up again. Some of you are waiting until your life becomes perfect, picture perfect, before you start do what God told you to do. If you're waiting on that, the moment you get perfect, God went take you to heaven. For there are no perfect deliverers apart from Jesus. Come on, talk to me, church of God. So while you are there, God says you must do what I've called you to do. There are too many of us in this open space. Too many of us online to have Jamaica under siege like it is. Mm. 
Jamaica is under siege by the devil. And the devil think that he's winning. And if you look upon the, the statistics, it look like him a win for true. Talk to me in the church of God. Every single day, it's not just one death, but deaths. Murder. Crime. Violence. Hello somebody here. Our altars have been built up all over our nation. Not giving authority and honor to God. But to demons and devils. Altars have been built up all over the city. And there are believers who are just sitting down. Because we have some struggles. Because we have some problems. We no longer intercede. We no longer pray. We no longer get up in the middle of the night. And pull down strongholds. So the enemy thinks that he has authority in Jamaica. Well to know night on this final night I come to call some deliverers to rise up in the name of Jesus rise up in power rise up in your authority rise up in the name of Jesus above Shatam higher and we decree tonight that we are taking back Jamaica in the name of Jesus we're taking back our schools we're taking back our young people in the name of Jesus what kind of new demons is happening in our schools the devil is a liar there is a church there is a people who are called to be deliverers oh if my people who are called by my name would humble themselves and pray seek my face turn from their wicked ways he said i will hear from heaven i will forgive your sins and i will heal your land god is waiting for a deliverer in the earth to cry out So tonight, I'm calling for a deliverer. I'm calling for one who was rejected, was not even invited to the party. But when Samuel went down to the house of Jesse, he was not even invited. He was not even called. But I'm reminding you that you might be in the backside of the desert watching over sheep. But there's an anointing that God has for you. There's a call that God has for you. And we will not sit down until you come good god almighty i feel the holy ghost tell somebody i'm the one i'm the one i'm the one i'm one of them i'm one of them i'm one of them i'm one of them i'm one of, i'm calling for the davids to arise i'm calling for an esther God Almighty. I say I'm calling for an Esther. You might have been an orphan. You might have lost some stuff. But God has called you into the kingdom for such a time as this. And if I perish, I perish. But I must see the king. Am I preaching to anybody yet? Good God Almighty. I'm calling for the deliverers. You might be hiding in the wine press, threshing wheat because you're afraid of the Midianites. You're afraid that they're going to come and take what you got. But right there hiding, hiding in the wine press, I hear the Holy Ghost says, I call you the mighty man of valor. Come out of that and come in at this. Come back your true purpose and your destiny in the name of Jesus I'm here to tell you tonight that if if every believer stand in our position stand in our place there's no demon that can overrun our parish our nation our house our household our community good God Almighty I'm here to tell you tonight that you are armed and extremely dangerous I'm here to tell you tonight you're anointed for such a time as this put your hand up in the ear and pull down something pull down strongholds you're watching online stand up and pull down some stronghold that is in your house in the name of Jesus as for me and my house we will serve almighty God I'm calling for the deliverers to find your place in the kingdom of God
Tell somebody I'm a deliverer. Me tired, but I'm a deliverer. I'm a bit hungry, but I'm a deliverer. Me don't have enough money, but I'm still a deliverer. I have some pain in my body, but I'm still a deliverer. Don't let that devil stop you. Don't let him discourage you. I am a deliverer. Can I preach what's in my belly? There are some deliverers that have stopped doing what God told you to do because of church politics. Who don't like you and who you don't like and you can't take this and you, you can't take that. Humble yourself and do what God called you for do. Humble yourself and do what God has called you to do. And everybody God calls him Mike. Our pulpit. Our podium. God Jesus. Some of you think that you're only anointed when you come around this podium and you begin to sing or you begin to speak. Oh no honey. You're anointed when you step in that classroom with some children we are in trouble. You're anointed in the name of Jesus when you step back into that house with that unseen spouse and children give you trouble. You are still anointed when you step into that bank. Can I preach to you here? You are not anointed just for pulpit you're not anointed for bike you're called to be a deliverer wherever you are right now you're a deliverer if you're the only one in your crew at school save you are a deliverer calling for the deliverers God said, Jesus says, call for my deliverers. He says, if my deliverers would rise up in this season and in this hour, we will take back the land. We will tear down every evil altar that has been risen up in Jamaica. Can I talk to you, church of the living God? Every altar that rise up, we decree tonight, there must be torn down. For even if we are afraid, we will be like Gideon. We will go by night and we will mash it up in the name of Jesus. For while, while, while we have been preaching from Sunday night until Friday night, you don't understand that we're not just coming here, sitting down and giving God praise. We are establishing a righteous altar right in Montego Bay. And from this spot of ground, we decree that Montego Bay, that St. James will never be the same again. I need somebody right Right now to lift up your right hand and give God a robo shataya a righteous praise in the name of Jesus. We are the deliverers. I say we are the deliverers. We are good God Almighty can I tell you something about deliverers deliverers don't complain about what is not happening or what is not taking place deliverers they don't complain about this or that they don't complain about changes Be deliverers become the change that you want to see deliverers stand in the gap deliverers build up the edge deliverers declare a thing and it shall come to pass come on talk to me church of God I am a deliverer Hallelujah. deliverers deliverers hear me you know you're a deliverer when you know that God has called you before you were formed in your mother's belly I knew you I ordained you and I sanctified you for such a time as this don't you dare make sambalat to buy or go sin talk cause you to come down from the wall talk to me somebody here don't you dare cause the sambalat spirit God if you come down from the wall tell them I'm too busy I don't have time to come down and not going me to at oh no oh no praise God I will stand my ground I will do what God has called me to do come hell or high water 
I shall not be moved but like a tree planted by the waters I shall not be moved come on your neighbor is talking to you say neighbor I am a deliverer you know you're a deliverer when somebody is sick in your house and you used to panic Ooh, Lord, what am I going to do? Ooh, Jesus. Lord, we're going dead now. Praise the name of the Lord. And your drawfy, panadol, your drawfy, fence, your drawfy, caffeine, your drawfy, this. You know you're a deliverer. When the first thing you draw, let us pray. Lord Jesus, I say, you know you're a deliverer. When all hell is breakthrough, breaking through, and you say, come on, family, let us pray. And you begin to call upon the name of the Lord. You are a deliverer. So while Jesus was in the earth as a deliverer, he began to train deliverers. Mm. Train them by what he said and train them by what he did. In St. Mark chapter 5, there are a few things that happen in that chapter revealing to the disciples that Jesus came to set captives free. He delivered a demonic man. That's the text where I am tonight. Following his deliverance, a man called Jairus Roll upon him and say, yo, Jesus, yes. my daughter sick. Yes. Come down to my yard and lay hands upon him. Talk to me. Yes. On his way down there, one woman, we popped down for 12 years. Yes. Talk to me in the church of God. Yes. Bleeding, yes. losing stuff. Losing blood, losing friends, losing family, losing communication, losing. She had to be quarantined. You know that word come up in a COVID. She had to be quarantined for 12 long years. Come on, without Wi-Fi, without cell phone, without TV, without Netflix. You're not talking to me, church of God. She was not entertained, but for 12 years, she was so messed up. But she heard that this deliverer was passing through Montego Bay. And she said, well, I ain't got nothing to lose. So she packed all the car, little things and said, here I come here I come Jesus the crowd was thick the crowd was hard she could not even move so she went real low and she began to press Tell somebody press she began to press and as she pressed good God Almighty she began to touch the hem of his garment for she said within herself if I may but touch the hem of his garment I will be made so she touched him and immediately the issue of blood dried up is there anybody in Montego Bay who have the audacity the God faith to lift your hand and touch Jesus and watch that sickness in your body disappear watch that Lord God bladder disappear Lord watch that cancer disappear Lord Jesus whatever report our lady got from the doctors today lord god almighty we decree and declare woman of god that if you near touch god tonight hey, go to whatever the doctors say there is gonna be a hey, reverse Hallelujah. somebody prayers gonna feel the holy ghost reverse reverse in the name of Jesus I speak to your blood works I command your blood works to line up to healing in the name of Jesus we scan your body by the power of the Holy Ghost and we decree from the crown of your head to the very soles of your feet we decree the healing virtue of the Lord Jesus Christ to locate you now in the name of Jesus woman of God look at me look at me look at me look at me I heard 
your testimony and it was a powerful testimony but can I trouble your testimony a little bit the last part of the testimony unless God ready me no one agree with that part if me miss you down here it's because you come at Kingston and I see you up there. Talk to me, somebody here. Hello, somebody. We say we will not accept the doctor's report. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, be healed from the crown of your head to the very soles of your feet. We reverse the negative report and I decree that he was wounded for your transgressions. He was bruised for your iniquities the chastisement of your peace was upon him and by his stripes we we decree that you are healed in the name of Jesus high five somebody give God praise tonight Hallelujah. Jesus this woman disturbed Jesus on his way to Jairus' house and got her miracle somebody got to disturb the service and get your miracle hey by this time somebody told him now worry yourself with the master for the daughter no longer sick the daughter is dead but Jesus wanted his disciples to know that I'm not only Lord over the diseased I am also Lord over death good God Lord Jesus so he got there put out the naysayers put out the doubters and Jesus says to leave thy kuma Damsel, arise! And the dead girl, Pitney, good God Almighty, got up out of her dead situation. For when the master speaks, dead got to listen. Can I preach tonight? Somebody have a dead situation. If the master ever speak to your dead marriage, it must come back to life. To your dead family, it must come back to life. To your dead business, it must come back to life. Jesus! The teacher, the rabbi, was teaching. So take me back to the text. Back to the text. There is a man. Somebody say a man. It could be you. It could be me. For the text, if you read it carefully, how he is in the text, and I say he start out. But something happened in this man's life that caused a demon called Legion. That means about two to six thousand demons full up this one man. Which tells me something about spiritual warfare and about the kingdom of darkness. For when he says that we are Legion, it means that we are organized. It means that we are regimented. It means that we march to one beat. They may unite because of fear, but they unite anyhow. It's just when you come to church, you see people divided. Oh, all right, praise God. It's just when you go to work, you see people divided. But a kingdom, Jesus says, divided against itself shall not stand. It tells me that the kingdom of the darkness is organized. So what is the church doing about being disorganized? We are organized. We are one beat. We are one voice tonight. I don't care which church you come from. Tonight I am New Testament. Come in their own New Testament. Even though me open Bible. Because every New Testament need an open Bible. You're not talking. Somebody praise the name of Jesus. Look at them and say, neighbor, I don't look like you, 
and you don't look as cute as me talk to me tell your neighbor you don't look like me but I don't care how you look tonight we agree as one we will not allow the devil to be more organized than us to be more disciplined than us to be more together than us for one shall chase a thousand two shall put ten thousand to flight if two shall agree touching anything Lord God Almighty it shall be done I wish I had a church tonight some going bus boat and I feel an anointing about to break loose tonight in this game meeting so walk with me now for when the devil catch this man he did what he does he did what he does the strategy of the enemy is to divide and conquer all the time divide and conquer because he knows together in can beat me so he divides and conquer for this man he divided and conquered first of all he divided the person the man like many people right now are divided in themselves double-minded the bible says something about double-minded that a double-minded man oh jesus you can know when someone is double-minded you see it in his unstable ways they don't know who they are they can't find their identity i must tell you it's not that i'm scared but sometimes i get a little bit nervous because I, 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 I'm hardly able to tell male from female. I, 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 I get nervous sometimes. I, I'm driving and, and I say, honey, a man that I... Because everything, everything my woman do, man I do it too. You know, appreciate me? I say, everything my woman do, man I do it too. Oh man, I wear knickers. Man, I wear knickers too. Oh man, walk so. Man, walk so too. Talk to me in the church of God. Oh man, wear earring. Man, wear earring too. Oh man, plat here. Man, plat here too. Oh man, a boyfriend. You're not preaching with me. You're not preaching with me. You're not preaching with me. No. Lord God Almighty. I, 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 don't, I don't understand. And the reason why there's a conflict in their minds is because the devil has divided and conquered. I don't know who I am. Is it my nature? Is it nurture? Is it something innate? Is it something from the world that I learned? I don't know. I don't know. Sometimes I feel like a man. Something I feel like, I, oh my, praise God. I'm conflicted. I'm conflicted. Some persons are conflicted. Why? The devil, he divides and conquers. But I claim tonight to clear the ear. If you are a man, you are a man. If you are a woman, you are a woman. Am I talking to you, church of God? The Lord allowed it that way. So when them look at the. What them call it? Before the baby born and them, them go down there. Ultrasound. When you look on the ultrasound, and the doctor said, look at something there. Yeah, boy! If that's something, then no, 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 no. Yeah, girl! No man, no dopey fool you. No man, no demon fool you. No man, no homosexual spirit and no lesbian spirit fool you. That devil is a liar. Lord God Almighty, the Lord knows who you are. Hear me tonight, man. Take a Do not allow the enemy to divide and conquer you. We decree and declare soundness of mind. Shut. 
Hey, I feel the Holy Ghost. Somebody, somebody pray for me, pray for me, pray for me, pray for me, pray for me. Rabo Shata Bahaya, Rabo Kotosi and I, I feel let me just lick something tonight. But we will lick it till him does in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah to God. Can I tell you who you are? You are a royal priesthood. You are a holy nation. You are peculiar. You are peculiar. You are peculiar. The only difference you got is not about the sexuality. The only difference you got is either your male or your female. All your tendencies must come under the blood of Jesus Christ. We decree it in our schools. We decree it in our homes. We decree it in our families. In the name of Jesus. Conflicted in yourself. Some persons are conflicted right now, dividing and conquer. Because you want to be saved. But you can't leave a man. He completes me. Preacher, he understands me. Preacher, he takes care of me. If, if Jesus come now, I ain't already I go to hell. I know it sounds strong, but me now I'll come back tomorrow. I might have me preach tonight. Heller. Conflicted. Conflicted right now. The reason you're in the gang is because you're conflicted. You never get no love at home. Daddy never hug you. Mommy not saying love you. But some man I tell you say them love you. They might take care of you. They might pay your bills. But they might put gun in your hand. And you know you're conflicted. Because you don't want to kill nobody. Because they ain't glorious so. And there's something on the inside telling you, though, get out! But you're conflicted. If I get out, they're going to kill me. If they, if I told, shut up. I, just say, to, if I, I can't, I can't, I can't come out. I can't come out. They say, it's your initiation. You got to kill somebody. And you're conflicted. Hear me tonight! Deliverance is here for you! God can't take you out of that and put you in at this. Oh Jesus, why am I on, why am I on this so long? The prodigal son left his father's house because he was conflicted. He, he, he was born in royalty. He was born in wealth. He was born in good stuff like born again believers. But he kept looking out and said, yo, that is host no look so good. That is host no feel so nice. That is host boring. So he became conflicted. Left his daddy's house. Got his money. Spent it out on gal. Galling. I'm here to preach. Mr. Galling. Drinking. Drugging. Talk to me. But the Bible says something that when everything done and he was now faced with a hog and the hog food, wondering if me should I eat the food here because me hungry like a hog. Something happened to this conflicted mind. The Bible says this young man came to himself. Good God. Somebody hear me tonight. You might be conflicted. But the Holy Ghost is saying to you. Come to yourself. I say I will arise. And go back to my daddy's house. I will repent. And I go back to my daddy's house. And when the boy. Who look like hog. Who sound like hog. Who smell like hog. By the time him reach the gate. Him daddy took off. At the veranda long time. Jump over the fence like Long time hug up the dirty boy kiss the dirty boy say he that was lost is now found i'm here to tell somebody who is conflicted that there is a loving god waiting for you to come home so he divided him in himself but divided also in his home jesus said to him at the end go home simply means he had a home but the devil won't take you out of your home can i talk to the men them look a bit can i talk to the men them look a bit he want to take the man them where the god man them they lift up on the hand he lift up on the hand and say you 
Aïe, on est there. God, the devil, wants to take us out of our homes, leaving the house without a priest, without a provider, without a protector. Are you hearing me, church of God? I'm not belittling any lady. Talk to me here. But there should be a priest in the house of God, in your home. And if you have somebody in your house and the devil is trying to take that priest out, woman of God, can I give you some advice? Come to pastor with your olive oil. Can I preach like I feel it? Me say if you might give you trouble and the devil want to take him out of the house one third party if he enter and infidelity Mr. say come consecrate your olive oil wait till him gonna work and night everything will belong to him and 19 shot and 19 shoes and 19 underpants and 19 you're not hearing me church of god hallelujah when you come in and 90 care wheel and 90 engine and the clear thing if you think you're bad left me again the devil is a liar and the creature tonight that he will not conquer he will not divide your house in the name of jesus i decree order hold on a minute i heard you i heard you sir but preacher them worse than we me hear you and the worse them worse than we are skill them skiller oh the amen them gone down now pastor Look well, me I talk about the bad man, them, you know. Everybody has say amen. No, me switch this flip, flip the script, and some people get silent. I've heard you. I've got one for my nails, I've got one for my rent, I've got one for my car payment, and none of them don't know. All right. Not even, not even one amen. What the god man, them, you know, say, yeah. All right. What the enemy wants to do, he wants to come into our families. He wants to come into our homes and cause some little bickering, some little foolishness. Me not chat to you, you're not chat to me. And if you ask some people, the reason why you're not chat, them can't even remember the reason why you're not chat. The devil is a liar. Mister, go home tonight and make it up with your husband, make it up with your wife, make it up with your children. Someone and ask them to me, you no. Know, it look like you're in a rough situation. Praise the name of the Lord. He divided him in himself. Dividing his house. No longer was he at home. But now, where was he? He was in the cemetery. Among dead things. In the tombs. Ask your neighbor, neighbor. What dead things are around you? What, what, what dead things are you participating in? Dead things. Dead things. I cannot... Sister, Sister Rob, I cannot for the life of me understand why people still have smoke. Me used to smoke. But me stopped smoke from cigarette was $5. How much for cigarette now? <laughs> I wonder how they... They know you. Them right for the something say. That this smoking, it kills. And care, I will appreciate me. Me say it kills and cause cancer. But you can't do without your jaw. Even if you have a teeth out, look at silver out of your wife's purse. Out of your picnic, them lunch money. If you buy cigarettes, dead things. Dead, you are dead. Dead, you are dead. Dead, you are dead. Somebody not hearing me tonight. You are bound to nicotine, bound to that drug. But tonight we came to deliver the captives. No, that. No, that. Let, let me testify something to you. See, before me get saved, me and a gunman, me, they are girl, man.
Girl, it's not that sound like bounty a long time here. Oh, no, no. When I got saved, I used to drink like a hard. My daddy was an alcoholic. And me inherited drink. And me, when he come home, we used to contend for the little piece of beer we left in the bottom. And we get hooked. Are you hearing me, church of God? So I used to drink no liquor. Me used to burn weed. The Kali one. That good one when you go. <coughs> that one. <there. coughs> me used to burn Mataral. Me never liked craving him like the smoother ones. So I was hooked. When me I eat lunch, me I drink not, not, not um, food punch, but me I drink one liquor for wash down. Are you hearing me, Church of God? I was hooked. The day I gave my heart to Jesus, there are some people who get deliverance gradually. I got mine instantaneously. God removed the taste of alcohol, of, of, of cigarette, of ganja. I didn't want any more of that. So somebody tonight, and I'll tell me, I'll tell you something where me no know. Me I tell you something where me know that if you are bound to any of these things, if you are with dead things that keep in your bound, tonight you can be delivered. Now can I tell you? By the way, let's look at the neighbor. Say neighbor. Come on, talk to someone. Say neighbor. Don't worry yourself. The man soon done preach him, soon done preach him, soon done. This man who had thousands of demons on the inside of him. Jesus in Mark chapter 4 left where he was to go to Gadara. Not for the governor general. Not to have a meeting with the town clerk. He came to Gadara for one reason. He came to Gadara for one man. On his way, the devil must have known that this man was about to be delivered. For here arose a great storm of wind that threatened the boat that Jesus was on. Good God Almighty. Trying to stop Jesus from getting to that man that needed him. The disciples panicked for fear. Jesus was asleep in the boat. They came as the clearest thou not that we perish. In his mind, he must have been saying, The master is teaching. You gotta learn when the master is teaching. Though the storm are raging around you, you must find rest. And peace in the eye of the storm. Somebody not hear me. Somebody not hear me. When all hell is breaking loose over your life. You must not have a nervous breakdown. For the peace of God. That pass it all. Alright Jesus. How I know that this, this storm was sent. By the enemy. Is that when Jesus got up. He did not rebuke the disciples. But when he got up. He rebuked the wind and the rain he says be still in the come on somebody he says be still and the storm ceased what preacher how do you know that that storm was sent by the devil for the same word that is used for rebuking the storm is the same word Jesus used when Peter's mother-in-law got ill and Jesus put his hand on her and rebuked that fever because the devil can use nature you're not hearing me I say he can use nature trying to stop the care meeting but some people fast and pray this morning and the Lord make it rain in the day and the rain tonight somebody give him praise and glory so watch this I'm almost there Jesus came across the sea for this man and as soon as Jesus' feet came to the shores of Gadara, the conflict in this man mounted. For here was a man 
who wanted to be delivered and here were some demons who got real scared so this man says look here no man me not even gonna walk till him me not gonna wait till him come because i need my deliverance today and the bible said that the man ran somebody shall run 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 jesus in other words i'm not giving these demons a second chance for me to come to jesus i'm not giving that woman a second chance for me to run or that man or that job tonight i'm gonna run when jesus saw zacchaeus he never said take a time and come he said make yes somebody said make yes so that jesus wants to say but him said in english make haste somebody said make yes run the bible said that he ran to jesus and did something that 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 that, that confused scholars because he ran to jesus and worshiped as the text say he bowed down and worship how can a demon possessed man worship jesus because of the conflict one man want worship the other one says shut your mouth it's not too far from here because some people come to church and the lord say worship and your flesh says shut your mouth you're not preaching with me church of god he says something you come to church and you want to worship god and your problems are shut your mouth i wonder which one of them are going to win tonight i wonder if there's any worshipers tonight who have a worship in spite of what you're carrying in spite of who you are in spite of is there anybody who have any kind of worship? so the bible said oh he ran to jesus and he worshipped. Jesus was still teaching. The disciples were watching. He says, what your name? I'm legion. For we are many. Jesus said, I command you to come out. He said, first of all, he recognized who Jesus was. You know? Demons know who Jesus is. Church of God, Jesus, demons know who Jesus is. If you ever use the name of Jesus real serious by faith, every demon in your house have to run. Talk to me, the church of God. For Colossians chapter 2 says, He spoiled principalities and powers when he rose from the demons know his name somebody said jesus 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 i feel the holy ghost on it somebody said jesus some eyes somebody said jesus somebody said jesus somebody said jesus somebody said jesus for god has highly exalted him and has given him a name above every other name but at the name of jesus every knee shall power of things in heaven Things on the earth, things beneath the earth, every tongue must confess. Hallelujah. Hear me. I'm almost through. Hear me. The demon said, Look here. Suffer us not to leave the region. Them like it where you are. Them like your body. Ooh. Them like your house. Them like Montego Bay. Because they are being entertained. They like your neighborhood because they suffer us not to leave the region. Them say anything you do, even if we have to come out of this man, put us in swines, but don't suffer us to leave the region. We want to stay here. Uno na Tanya! Someone on our preach with me tonight, you know. Someone on our preach with me tonight. Someone forget militant. Mr. Devil, you're not Tanya. Look here, no man. You're not paying no rent. You're not paying a light bill. You're not paying a water bill. You're not buying no grocery. You're not Tanya. I give you eviction notice tonight. This is the last night you will be in my house. This is the last night you will be in my body. This is the last night you will be in this region. You're not Tanya. We evict you tonight in the name of God Almighty. I am a 
shut up. Somebody give God worship. I feel the oil of the anointing. I feel the power of God. I feel the authority of the name of Jesus. Somebody must be loose tonight from that demon that has held you down. Hallelujah. Look here. I've got to talk about the grace of God that kept the man alive for years or months or weeks with demons. The demons that were in him were so strong that when they went into 2,000 swines, not even the swines wanted these demons. The swines said me, well, I'd rather die than live with these demons. Lord God Almighty, even swines are wiser than some people. That you're living with this devil. You're living with these demons. You're living in this conflicted time. And you want to serve God. And you will not surrender your heart to the Lord. The Bible said when the demons went into the swine. Not even the swines wanted the demon. How on earth did he survive? With these kinds of demons. It was the grace of God that kept him. To the point of his deliverance. Tonight, the grace of God has kept you to the point of your deliverance. This man wanted to be delivered and he ran to Jesus. And Jesus cast that demon out of him. Now look at the conflict and I'm closing. When the demon left the man, the man sat in his right mind and the people <laughs> were more afraid of the same man than the demon possessed man the man was no sane clothed looked decent and nice and the people them say lord jesus they told jesus to leave montego bay don't you dare ever tell jesus to leave when he brings deliverance to you Grab deliverance with both hands. Yes. Ooh, Bahaya. I close with this. The man ran behind Jesus. For he was leaving. And while he was leaving, he says, Jesus, may I follow back on you? Pee pee, clock, clock. May I come with you? Wherever thou goest, I will go. Jesus said, oh no. I have delivered you to be a deliverer. Jesus says, go back home and begin to tell the people what happened to you. Well, Montego Bay, from Sunday night to Friday night, we day every night, we tell you what Jesus has done for me. Look what the Lord has done. He healed my body. He touched my mind. He saved me just in time. I'm going to praise this. Is there anybody up in here who can testify? Look what the Lord has done. You should have seen me a few years ago when I was lost in sin. But look at me now. I'm looking in. I'm looking out. I'm looking even better. Somebody praise God. Somebody give him glory. Somebody magnify him. He delivered you to be a deliverer tonight. When you go home, tell the people. Tweet at them. Tweet them. Lord God, WhatsApp them. Instagram them. Facebook them. Text them. Say, look what the Lord has done. I want the church to stand with me. Shakori amai soto. Shadow shiaya. Shakori anda la basaya. Shaki oto korobo anda. Oh God. I want us tonight. We preach when we preach like this, the devil gets crazy. Demons are wait, they know. Waiting and left here. Yeah. No, we're not free. We're not ignorant concerning his devices. I want us to lift up the name of Jesus seven times before I call somebody to run to Jesus. Hallelujah. I don't want you to call it because 
the preacher said, I want you to call it because you are a deliverer. And out of your mouth comes the name of Jesus that will cause deliverance to the captives. Put your hand on your head. I say, I'm anointed for this. Jesus. Oh God Almighty. Put your, say it again one more time. I'm anointed for this. One more time, say, I'm anointed for this. In fact, just pray, Mr. Lord, I thank you for your deliverance. Tonight, Lord, I believe that you came. I believe that you died on the cross for my sins. I believe that your blood redeems me covers me justifies me right now I decree and declare that I'm a child of God sanctified justified made clean I stand now in the authority of the name of Jesus and I give every demon notice from my life I command you to leave my presence now some of you are not serious it I command you to leave my presence now leave my mind now leave my body now in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus you have no legal right to my life in Jesus name go now in Jesus name lift up a praise to the Lord lift up a praise to the Lord Holy Ghost! Every deliverer, every deliverer that is standing, those who are watching, partner with us tonight. Stand up in your living room unless you're driving but stand up with us we want i want you to echo the name of jesus until the neighbor on the scheme that you're living here you let demons know we're taking back jamaica tonight lord god lord jesus i just need some militant people with faith lord god almighty rabo shatai are you ready are you ready it is seven souls i hear in my gut in my spirit seven shout of the name of jesus before i make any kind of altar call one jesus two jesus three Jesus! For Jesus! Your sons and daughters must be delivered. Your spouse must be delivered. Your boss must be saved. In the name of Jesus. Five! Jesus! Six Jesus for the seventh one for the seventh one join your hands with your neighbor this one is a partnership this one is unity this one is oneness 
and they were in one accord they were in one place Rakoto Shandai at the seventh shout I want you to put a praise at the end of the seventh shout for I decree and declare that the deliverance is coming to your house to your family in the name of Jesus seven Jesus come on put the praise on it 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 Robo Shandai Rakatababa Shandai Robo Koto Shandai Bahaya in the name of Jesus Holy Ghost Mandaraba Shotobo Oh Oh in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus oh 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 somebody lift up a prayers at the end come on come on come on come on come on lift up that prayers lift up that worship lift it up let that devil know that I'm totally free I'm completely free somebody tonight will have no alternative procrastination will not take them their minds will be made up they will be running to Jesus for the atmosphere is charged with the Holy Ghost yeah, 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 yeah. Listen at me. The devil's strategy is to divide and conquer. Tonight, if you're feeling conflicted as to whether tonight is your night of deliverance, your night of salvation, hear me the bible says today if you would hear his voice harden not your heart for today salvation has come to your house i'm gonna show salvation one time and every person that is not saved i don't want you to trust to walk if you, if you have to walk, walk fast. But I want you tonight to run to Jesus. Not to the preacher. The deliverer has come to make you a deliverer. Salvation! Run, come. Run, come. Miss if you run, come. Miss if you run, come. Salvation! Run, come. Run, come. Run, come. No, Lele. Mr. Run come, my shot oh Rabahaya. She ought to Rabaha Kotobo Shataba. Salvation! Run come, 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 run come. Ah, Kutu Shaya. Is there a praising church? Is there a praising church? Is there a worshiping church? Is there a worshiping church? Salvation! Run come, run come. Run come, run come. Today is your day. Tonight is your night. Salvation is here for you. Deliverance is here for you. Church, lift your hands. Come on, just wave them. Just wave you in the spirit realm. My God Almighty, wave your hands out, clap them out of something. Stamp your feet, wave here. Fall upon serpents and scorpions, upon everything that would want to bind them tonight. Run, come. This is the last night of the feast. If you hear his voice, harden not your heart. Hasten, not really. Run, come. Run, come. Run, come. Mm. There is no satisfaction without salvation. S A L. No, you can't. No, satisfaction. 
Salvation without salvation. S A L V A T I O N. Shout it out! Shout it out! Shout it out! Shout it out! Loud and clear! Loud and clear! S A L B H I O N. You can't, you can't go to heaven. No, you can't go to heaven without, without salvation. We're waiting on you. Come. S A L B H I O N. I O N. Shout it out! Shout it out! Lord and Lord and Shout it out! Prodigal's daughter, prodigal's son. Okay. Pastor Francis, come here. Come Ladies and gentlemen, can you give me just one minute and I'll come right back to you? One minute. There may be somebody who wants to come. So I'm, I'm going to ask you to do this walk down there. And I'm going to walk around there. We're going to meet somewhere in the middle. If you want to come to the altar, you're afraid. We are come for you. So if we are passing, you want to come? Just follow back away. Oh, my son. I was on. What do you want to say? Listen to lift up the song again one more. Tell that prodigal boy, tell him to come without delay. Tell that prodigal boy, tell that prodigal boy, tell that prodigal boy, tell him to come without delay. Tell that prodigal boy. Tell him to come. Oh, we are calling you from sin. We are calling you from sin. We are calling you from sin. Oh, tell that prodigal boy. Tell him to come. Prodigal girl, tell her to come without delay. Tell that prodigal girl, tell that prodigal girl, tell that prodigal girl, tell her to come without delay. Tell that prodigal girl, tell her to come. Oh, we praise God. Your forward respect in every aspect. Somebody say amen. In a walk with you saying this walk with us and come, but in forward respect. Somebody say amen. amen. I need one believer to each person at the altar and rest your hands on both shoulders. I need one believer to each person at the altar. Rest your hand on both shoulders right now. I need, a, I need some men for these men. Come on quickly. I need a believer for every person at the altar. Put your hands on both their shoulders. Both. I need two ladies right here. Come on, move quickly, Church of God. Come on. Come on, two ladies right here, right here, right here, right here. There's a gentleman right here. Praise God. There's three ladies at the front. I need three ladies at the front right now. Come on, come on, move, move. Come on, Church of God. Come on, come on, come on. If you understood the warfare that takes place at an altar, you would move quickly. Come on, this is warfare right now. Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Hallelujah to God. I need one more lady for this lady right here. For this lady right here. For this lady right here. Put both hands on their shoulders. Put both hands on their shoulders. Your two hand them. Praise God. Miss, uh, uh, 
put on your hand, make sure you put it Yes. Somebody hold your shoulder. Are you special tonight? Praise God. Every believer, stretch your hands toward this altar now. Praise the name of the Lord. And for 60 seconds, I want you to release a prayer that these who have come have not just come for prayer, but we decree salvation tonight. Come on, begin to intercede right now, right now, right now. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Holy Spirit, salvation is of you. This, this is what you do. You convict men of sin. You convict men of judgment. You convict men of righteousness. In the name of Jesus, every blind minding spirit, we bind you from this altar. In the name of Jesus, every spirit of putting it off, procrastination. In the name of Jesus, as they come to believers, just join them. Rabo Shatabahaya and begin to intercede now, now, now. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Rabba Sakotore and the Bahaya. Come on, proceed, proceed, proceed. Their souls, salvation, the war that is happening right now, the conflict that is taking place right now. We decree soundness of mind, conscious decisions to serve Jesus for the rest of their days. In the name of Jesus, mighty God, even those who are watching, Father, we pray for the mindset to change. We pray for the hearts to be changed. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Ikabu Shatanana Mahaya. Oh! Come on, no Shababa Satana Babo Shete Behendel Bissot. Shatarana Babo Shete Bico Shobo Wundu Bosha. Talalaba Satabo Shinda. Come on, water their souls. Come on, water them, water them with prayer. Water them, water them, water them, water them, water them, water them. Water them. Transformation. Change. Transformation. Change. Transformation. Change. In the name of Jesus. God, we pray for regeneration. We pray for sanctification. We pray for justification to take place at this altar tonight. Let there be a change. Let there be a transformation. Let some be blocked out of the fire tonight in the name of Jesus the hold that the enemy would have on them the conflict that would have been in their minds and in their hearts is now diminished nullified crushed annihilated in the name of Jesus God we praise you we praise you somebody clap your hands and give the Lord praise we have cast the net tonight and these precious souls have come I'm going to now invite to give the great honor with these, with, with these that have come. Associate Pastor, would you come and lead them to the Lord? Huh? By faith believing, just say this prayer with me. Dear Lord, I thank you for grace. Dear Lord, I thank you for your love. I am happy that I am here tonight to hear your word. Faith cometh not by hearing. Rather, faith cometh but by hearing the word of the Lord. Tonight, Father, I declare, I decree that tonight is my night for deliverance I declare that tonight is my night for walking in newness Father God I accept your gift of salvation tonight Lord I accept your gift of life so Father come into my heart even now wash me lord of all my sins cast them lord into the sea of forgetfulness make me whole restore my life and let it be pleasing to you in the name of jesus have thine own sweet way in jesus name amen and amen. Amen.
It doesn't take a year to be saved. But just by believing what that prayer that you just prayed, it is done. It is done. Is there one tonight? On the last day of this camp meet that will be saying, Tonight is my night to walk with the Lord. Yes, I have gotten some bruises. Yes, I have been battered. And I'm still going through. But I am declaring and decreeing that tonight is my night to walk with the Lord. You are here and you are saying yes. Could you raise that hand? Without fear or favor, can you raise that hand? Tonight is your night. Tonight is your night. Tonight is your night. Is there any other? Tonight is your night. Is there any other? Is there any other? My brother, what, what about you? You put up your hand. God be the glory. What about you? God be the glory. What about you? Your hand went up. Mother, what about you? Your hand went up. Are you saying Jesus? Look at me, man. If you're not saying Jesus, I don't want to force you. Are you saying Jesus? If you're saying Jesus, raise up your hand like you mean what you're saying. Is there any other, my brother? It's a tug of war, but will you, will you say yes to the Lord? Will you say yes to the Lord? All those that are saying yes, just raise those hands once more. Raise it, let the enemy see you. If you said yes to the Lord, raise that hand. Somebody help me to praise the Lord. What about you? What about you? All of you. You raise your hand. Join me up here. You raised your hand. Come up here. What about you? What about you? Tonight is your night. Somebody help me to praise God. Somebody help me to praise God. Can I feel the church help me to praise God? My brother. Give God that chance. We made a bridge in the seminar. Fire. Give God a chance. Give God a chance. My sister. My sister. Give God a chance. My friend. You. You see you? Look at me, man. Give God a chance. Come here. I hand it over to Bishop. Get ready to hand over to Bishop. Give God a chance. It will not get any better. Give God a chance. Let God fix it for you. He will do it. May not ask you. I tell me. I tell you. Give God a chance. Those tears you cry is not because you want to cry the Holy Ghost. Give God a chance. Give God a chance. The rescue boat is passing. Give God a chance. Somebody help me to praise God. Somebody help me to praise God. I use the keys of the kingdom. I loose you from the crown of your head to the very sole of your feet. Everything that has your life bound up tonight will loose you now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Woman, be thou loose in Jesus' name. Somebody praise the Lord. Somebody praise the Lord. Will you say yes tonight? Will you say yes tonight? 
Will you say yes tonight? It's a tug of war, but give God a chance. Fight that devil. And give God a chance. I tell you again. Give it over to the Lord. Give him a chance. I want to hand over to Bishop Robinson in the name of the Lord. Praise God. There is power in the name of Jesus. Come here. Come here. Pretty girl. Come here before you go. Sir. Every chain. Break every chain. Sir. Break every chain. I want to pray for you quickly. Father, we come in the name of Jesus. We thank you for these who have responded to the altar call. But God, these four, whatever it is that allow them not to say yes, exercise in faith, thou knowest. I ask you, Lord, in wrath, remember mercy. Lord, who knows, oh God, that this week of camp meeting was designed for their salvation. I ask you for mercy. I ask you for mercy. Whatever, whatever the hindrances are, I pray that you will take them away. And let them surrender to you. Thank you for hearing. In Jesus' name. Before you go back to your seat, one last chance. Are you willing to follow the Lord tonight? You are free to join this group that is on stage. Tonight is your night. God bless you for coming. God bless you for coming. You may return to your seat. Thank you. Thank you for coming. Come on, there is power. In the name, in the name of Jesus. Come on, church. Come on, church. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus. As you stretch your hands towards these, could, could the counselors just pause? Could the counselors just pause? I want the church to join me to pray for these. Stretch your hands right now. The devil is mad. The hellbound train is a little lighter. Amen. Come on now, I want you to help me pray for them right now. I believe in the power of the church's prayer. Eternal Father, I call on heaven right now to release angels and assign these angels to these who have decided for you. It's not an easy task to make a decision when their mouths to feed when their bodies are sick when there are temptations in the way they don't know what the future hold but God they have decided for you I pray for strength I pray for coverage I pray that through the Holy Ghost you will intensify their conviction let them not be like others who showed up and never to show up again Lord will you touch them in a very special way melt oh God anything any barrier 
any voice apart from your voice that is speaking now we send it to the pit of hell lord there are converts on the air on the youtube platform will you touch them every request i make for these will you answer lord god for those who are on the youtube platform in the name of jesus there are others who have testified i pray that you will touch them in the name of jesus strengthen them we give you thanks we give you praise hallelujah lord come stretch your hands still i pray for the preacher come on now everybody god gave us a list of preachers this week they are divinely chosen we thank you for reverend roberts we thank you for the anointing lord everything every word said tonight is not by him or self but through the anointing of the holy ghost will you just touch him touch his wife touch his children touch his ministry touch his church that you have assigned to him god i ask you right now to lay your mighty hand oh god on onisha right now in the name of jesus daughter be healed in the mighty name of jesus onisha be touched i ask you to lay that nail pierced hand oh god on the granddaughter of sister joyce lynn you know the name you know the number you know the address can you do it now in the name of jesus i pray for georgia garcia llewellyn right now in the name of jesus can you stretch your hand towards cornwall regional come right now you know the ward you know the bed i claim healing in the name of jesus come with me church healing there is a mother's request oh god what medicine cannot do lord you can in the name of jesus i place sister velma hamilton in your hand from linstead saint catherine you are a prayer answering god i pray for sister duane and her son from linstead saint catherine i pray for sister janice oh god for her and her son i call heaven's attention from linstead saint catherine hallelujah i ask you right now to visit sister walters all the way in florida he she needs a visitation if there is any sick in the house come on raise your hand oh god i release healing in the name of jesus and the closing moment of this camp meeting your healing your power is still available in the name of jesus cover every man woman boy girl the musician the operator the technical team this the security oh god almighty this office staff lord the ladies and their project i just cover everyone in the name of jesus oh god the 2400 online i pray for a mighty touch a mighty move in the name of jesus let somebody shout hallelujah let somebody shout hallelujah. hallelujah glory to god go ahead and finish your work counselors hallelujah come on give put your hands above your head give the lord a hand clap praise right now it's going home time but listen listen before you go why are you running away leaving me come back come back i have something to tell you you're too pretty to be running away from me quickly amen put your hands together the pretty light button oh god put your hands together for them 
stay with me I just have something lovely to tell you we give God thanks for them and we want them to be in church on Sunday whether it is the 730 service or the 11 o'clock we want you to be there in the name of the Lord amen come properly cover yourself and come you may not have an expensive church dress but properly clad yourself and come in the name of the Lord clothes will come in time and on time come on somebody I wonder if you agree with me praise God I'm asking the converts team get ready to be on the phone to keep in touch with them go home call somebody tell somebody that you have given your life to the Lord amen 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 God bless you as you return to your seat put your hands together for them in Jesus name hallelujah praise God could you get your belongings in your hands get your belonging in your hands and just don't stand I never ask you to stand just get it listen listen can we put our hands together for the Trinity the vote of thanks is going now praise God when the Lord flesh out this vision the council never object I mean all now I don't give them a budget but they never objected they were under all the others put your hands together for the council men and women come on a man come on when I watch Deacon Deacon Roden patrol the streets with his men I said to God be the glory Amen Amen could we put our hands together for the intercessors they stormed the fort in fasting in prayer meeting um, in cell group meetings for this camp meeting to God be the glory I want us to put our hands together for the evangelism director and the evangelism team headed by brother Gawood can we put our hands together for the guest speakers from Sunday until tonight and their spouses put your hands together for them for the visiting ministers and the churches put your hands together for them for the choir directors and the choirs put your hands together for them the moderators the devoters the intercessors put your hands together for them amen the musicians and the media team the engineer they had some rough time pulling and joining up and covering up what a team come on regardless of the rain they were still working around the clock I am going to make sure that they get a good Malta in the name of the Lord put your hands together for the camera team they pick up every living thing and show it to the world what the Lord is doing on on site glory to God we give God thanks for the security yes headed by Deacon Roden put your hands together there is not a reported case of lust of burglary or theft we give God thanks for the vigilancy of the security team headed by Deacon Roden and other security personnel for the carpenters and the electricians who have built this huge strong rostrum come on put your hands together oh lord it could hold a hundred of us still standing for our decorator sister williams and her team the ambience i have gotten calls of commendation it looks official and it is official come on a man don't be that mean montego bay is on the top montego bay is a brand and we give god thanks we give god thanks for the visitors some are here tonight some never showed up but could we put our hands together for the visitors from other churches from the community from elsewhere we give god thanks for you the new converts we give god thanks come on everybody put your hands together for the new believers in the lord the hospitality team that gives some refreshment and um when i order malta for the musician when they're 
uh, it seemingly that the blood sugar was dropping a little I ordered Malta for them and it spruce up their blood uh, sugar they could pay a little harder come on put your hands together for the hospitality team headed by our brother Clark the woman and cross and craft festival workers they fed us and still feeding us behind stage at peppercorn rate montego bay style um, and they still have something for you to grab and go at peppercorn rate we want you to do so amen um, for the online worshipers tonight we have over 2400 online live worshipers and i am told we must multiply that by three amen come on oh man come on i want our online worshipers god favored us we want to put our hands together for the staff my staff they work round the clock to allow this to be put together and do the fine printing can we put our hands together for the staff members to god be the glory if i overlook anyone forgive me i'm still human and god is still working on me to make me what i ought to be somebody stand with me the inaugural camp meeting it is just the beginning the better and best of camp meeting is yet to come in the name of the Lord I'm asking the converts committee team to get on the phone talk to every convert those who never showed up call and talk to them encourage them to be in church those who turn up tonight and decided for the Lord give them a call those who never surrender don't leave them out give them a call encourage them to come to church amen amen church somebody worship the Lord hallelujah I don't know if I overlook anyone amen my deputy is making sure I remember brother Sims and team but I did already but put your hands together for surety sake for brother Sims and team again in the name of the Lord amen there are a few selected persons who ensure that pastor is okay you don't see them but they're working behind the scene amen put your hands together for them love you thank you god bless you i want to before i pronounce the benediction i want to big up my senior citizens and members who you could have stayed home but listen i saw you dancing i saw you dodging the rain i said look at the seniors the mean business put your hands together for them my god love you in the name of the Lord. The Lord bless you and keep you. And be gracious unto you. And cause his face to shine upon you. The Lord lift up the light of his everlasting countenance upon you. And give you peace and rest till he comes. We all say. And everybody say. I'm asking the brothers don't run away. There are some things to go on the inside. You are needed. If the ladies can help us just to fold a chair or two and just lead them up, lean them up somewhere. Where's the praise team? Come on up here, Sister Sims. Funeral tomorrow for our brother. Brother Reed, I want everybody to be out as we bury him in fine style. 11 o'clock. Come on, raise my. Come, praise team. Come on, sing us out in the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise God, I'm free. I've been set free by the grace of God. I am free. No more the path of sin I trod. I am free. The blood has cleansed every sinful stain. I am free. I'm free again. Yeah.
the best I can. Do it. Be kind to to kind me day and night. Just a Jesus, oh my head. Just a Jesus, oh my head.